Hey there football fans, welcome back to Soccer News Center. Today, we've got some interesting news coming out of Old Trafford. Manchester United's new signing, Rasmus Hodgland, had a tough debut as the team suffered a 3-1 defeat against Brighton. But despite the disappointment, Hodgland is remaining positive and sending a strong message to the Man United fans. In his Instagram post, Hodgland shared a picture of himself at Old Trafford with the caption, We will rise again. Thanks for the warm welcome Old Trafford. It's great to see the young Norwegian staying optimistic and showing his determination to bounce back from this defeat. Hodgland had a promising start to his United career, making a positive impact in his debut against Arsenal. And even in this match against Brighton, he showed his potential as a bright spark for a team that's facing a lot of challenges right now. Unfortunately, he was substituted during the second half, with Anthony Marshall replacing him. And this decision didn't sit well with the Old Trafford crowd, as they booed the substitution. But despite the mixed reaction from the fans, manager Eric Ten Hag praised Hodgland's performance. He mentioned that the young striker had a great game and the fans embraced him. Ten Hag also acknowledged the disappointment of the disallowed goal, which would have been a fantastic moment for Hodgland. But he assured everyone that Hodgland is a strong character, and both he and the team will keep pushing forward. Now, Manchester United's season doesn't get any easier as they prepare to face Bayern Munich in the Champions League. The German giants will be hosting the Red Devils, and all eyes will be on Harry Kane, who was previously linked with a move to United. It's going to be a tough challenge, but United will be looking to bounce back and prove themselves on the European stage. That's all for today's update. What do you think of Rasmus Hodgland's message to the fans? Do you think Manchester United can recover from their recent struggles? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more football news. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time on Soccer News Center.